Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasuke channel. Today we are going to create a simple 2D flow pen with a cut direct 2022. Okay, first I will create new drawings and you can use a default settings, use a drawing type in DWG and use a template drawings you can get next. In here I will change for iCAD metric. Finish. So it we go into uh, our cut direct 2022 drawings area. If you want to change unit, you can tap unit, press enter, and in here you can change for in certain scales like uh, we set default in millimeter. You also can click uh, coordinate inputs in here and click enter the snaps. We select all snaps uh, options. You can click OK. Now uh, we start to draw wings, so you can tap L to use a line command. Okay, I will click start this point. And you can tap it. The next I will set into 9000. Okay, you can use scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out. And you can press scroll mouse to use pen tools. I will move to the top here with uh, length 3000. Okay, to the left here, 1,000. Move to the top, 3,000. Okay, and move to the left here, 8,000. And you can connect into this point. Okay, the next I will create line, start from this point, and you can move into here. I will use uh, capitals, we copy this line objects and you can move to drag here we can set into 3000 and we set again 5000 okay the next is a trim command you can tap the R press enter twice okay we can cut in here and also we we'll cut at this point okay now we can use a join command to combine these two line objects and also I will combine uh, this line subject press enter to combine okay you can use offset tool you can tap offset and press enter you can set for offset distance into 150 press enter again and I will get this line objects hit inside the next uh, we offset again with offset distance 75 click uh, this line objects and move to the right here also move to the left same at uh, these objects, these points, and also these points. Next, I will select uh, these middle lines and you can press delete button to delete. Use a uh, trim command again. Okay, we cut uh, these objects and objects also at this point. Okay, the next here. And the last at uh, this point. Okay, now we create a design simple four pen sketch. I will create a simple door. You can press L to use line command. Okay, we move to the top here about 1000. And you can use arch tools. You can type arch, press enter. Press C to start from center point. We have these points. And you can move to track here. 1000 and move to this point. Okay, I will copy this object to the right here, like we can set into copy. Okay, and red line start from this point into here. Move again to this point, like we can set into 50. Okay, move to the bottom here, 150. Select at this point. Okay, you can hold at this point and move to the bottom here. So it will be tracing and you can click at this point. The next, I will use uh, copy tools to copy the subjects from this point and you can move to here. Okay, I will group uh, these uh, all objects. You can type group and set the near name into door. For objects, you select all these all objects, press enter again, and you can click OK. So it will be grouping. 
The next, I will move for uh, this uh, object start from this point and then move into here. Okay, I will copy this object to here and then we can use uh, the tools to add this object. Okay, use some mirror tools uh, to mirror this object start from this point into here and I will tap yes, press enter. We can move again this object, start from this point into this point. We use our copy tools to so we'll copy this object into here and we do that again to this point. Now you can use move tools, move from this point into here. Okay, then next we copy this object. Okay, uh, here uh, we can correct the line. Okay, so from this point into here, we can set it to 100, sorry, 1000, and we can move into here. The next, I uh, will use chain command to join uh, these objects, and we can set it to offset uh, this end 150 at this point and click that. Inside here, okay, you can use frame tools to add this line of text and also at this point. Next, uh, we can copy these objects and then we can use uh, the tools. Move again from uh, this point into here. Okay, now I will use uh, frame tools to get uh, this line of text. Also here and uh, this current subjects. Okay. The next, uh, I will create a simple windows. You can use uh, the rectangle tools. Okay. From this point, I will set into one thousand three hundred and for width and set one hundred fifty as center to point. Okay. You can cut line start from this point into here. And now I will use uh, crop tools with name window select object. You can select uh, these objects and then click OK. I will change color for uh, these uh, objects. These are uh, property tools, and for color in here, I will set into this color. Okay, brown. And then use move tools to move all these objects that form middle point into here. So copy tools to copy these objects from the middle point in here. You can set at this point. Next, uh, I will set in here. Okay, and you can press the three button to close. Okay, now uh, I will apply hatch into this uh, wall. You can tap hatch. Press enter. I will change color for hatching in here. We can set into another color. We can clear, select colors and I will set into this color. Can click OK. For scale in here, I will set into 25. You can click uh, pick internal points. Okay, click at this point. So also at this point in here and the rest at this point. Press enter again, and you can click OK to apply. So it will be apply hatch into these walls. Okay. The next, uh, we can press F7 to hide cut, and I will set text in here. You can use uh, F text, text command. Press enter. Click from this point to here. Okay. For name here, I will set into room one. You can click offset so it will be small in the text and you can set for text height in here I will set in 25 so this is uh, for 25 for uh, text height set again you can set into 50 here I will set into 150 so this is uh, for 150 
it also can change for text colors and set into shine and then make rules make the shine point next is our copy tools to copy the text there will set me here this point in here and will set this point okay I will set the name in here into room 2 in here we can set into living room okay in here we set into kitchen and in here we set into toilet okay we can just move to move uh, text to the center point also at this point Okay, now uh, we can apply dimension into this block plan. You can tap D to open a dimension style. We can create new and our active uh, annotative. Click continue. Okay, for arrows, I will set into architectural D. The next, for lines in here, we can set into red. Okay, also in here, set into red. Now oh, for text, uh, for text color, we can set it green. This uh, for greens. Primary units, we can set position to zero, and you can click OK. Then close. Next, I will change for scale in here. We can create a new scale. We can click here that scale is. I will add new scales, you can set units in here into 75, 9, 1, 75. Can click OK, OK again, and you can set into 175. You can tap uh, Gim Link to write a dimension linear. Okay, you can cut start on screens. And I will press the button, right click, you can just meet between uh, two points map. Click on this point, and click at this point, then move into the So it is test with the center point with the this uh, two corner. Okay, we wrap again, dimension linear, start on this point. Then click, meet the point here. That's fine. Okay, and we grab again from this point. Okay, we click at this point. Click at this point, and here we can set from this point. Okay, next uh, we grab again from my uh, point in here and into this point. Again, you can use a sand stick from this point to here. Okay, but again, from this point to this point, and then from this point to this point. Okay, you also can select cards of checks and can to here. Here, click on this point. Here. Okay, next in the top here, you can grab a green link, you mentioned here. Here, on this point. We are using uh, between two points map. Okay, here, add option. And next on this point to this one. Okay, you can select our subjects here on this point and here. You also can select our this global dimension on this point too. The last four match points in this one. Okay, in uh, the left here, correct. 
entering the center point from this corner. Right again from this point. Okay. And the last and set from this corner point into this point. Don't forget to use uh, scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out and also use a pen tools. Okay. Now uh, we already create uh, this uh, simple pro pen with uh, copyright 2022. And if you have any question about this uh, tutorials, you can comment below this video.